My name is Jack Sullivan. I'm going to be telling you about a man called Thomas Andrews. Thomas Andrews was a man who, who designed and built Titanic. He spent seven years on it, and if we're lucky, we might just get to see him at work. Come on. Tom, Thomas Andrews built, built the ship of iron. He claimed it unsinkable because its watertight doors and bulkheads in, in the 26th century. When he was working during the voyage, he felt, a, he felt some shaking. So he went off to the bridge and asked what, what was going on. And this is where he's working. He's, he's in. Let's go see what he's doing. Hello, my name's Jackson. Please may I interview you? Oh, hello. Hello, I'm, I'm, I'm Thomas Andrews. I'm working on my ship, the Titanic. These are the parts that I need to put on to finish my model. And then the building can begin! And this is my handy screwdriver. Very good for building and hammering. What got you into building ships? Well, well, when I was young, me and my dad, we'd get some planks of wood and turn them into little boats and put them in our pond and, and watch them sail away. Who thought of the name Titanic? The person who thought of the name Titanic were, were, was, a man, was a man called Joseph Bruce Ismay who worked at the Harland and Wharf in Belfast. And they'll, and they'll be starting construction in a couple of years. Mm. Tell me about it. I, I can assure you that it's going to be the biggest ship in the world. It's going to have four funnels, but 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 the but only three are going to be working funnels because one at the back. Because I thought for the Titanic would would wouldn't look as nice with only three funnels, so I put an extra funnel at the back for decoration. This is a two-scale model of the Titanic. I've been practicing on the funnels. The funnels are going to be, are going to be that that exact shape. It's going to have a crane at, at the front to load cargo, and and it's going to have 20 lifeboats. And there's going to be 2,207 passengers. And the Titanic has in first class. There there is a grand staircase. And I think that is very, 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 very grand staircase. And in second class, it's better, but not as good. It's sort of like like how you are at your homes right now. And third class, you have to you have you have to share a room, four people, and you have to sleep in bunk beds, and you only get one tiny porthole, and no luxury at all. Bye-bye. Good luck with Titanic. Hope it doesn't sink. Let's go leave him to work with the Titanic. Good interview, wasn't it? Thought so.